harassment, the um, lack of equity that has been provided for disabled individuals and that now is even being discussed by the administration is so intolerable that I can't quite put it into words. I can tell you that every time you raise issues of sex but equal, the outrage of disabled individuals across the country is going to continue. It is going to be ignited. There will be more takeovers of buildings until finally maybe you begin to understand our position. We will no longer allow the government to up oppress disabled individuals. We want the law enforced. We want no more segregation. We will accept no more discussion of segregation. And I would appreciate it if you would stop shaking your head in agreement when I don't think you understand what we are talking about. Are we going to perpetuate segregation in our society? We're one of the largest minorities in, in this country. The issue of civil rights, of human rights, are not one issues that people with disabilities can compromise any further. It seems to me, and as I'm speaking, I'm speaking now both as a person who's severely disabled and who's been through some of the most traumatic kinds of experiences about my own image, about my own work, <coughs> self feelings about work, the kinds of feelings when I was younger that were constantly reinforced of no future for a person like myself. I could forget about being ever being married my wife next to me. Uh, I could forget about really participating fully in the society. And I found, and millions of other people with disabilities are finding, that access, that my ability to move around, and that my ability to regain the pride in myself as a person with a disability is one of the, the most important things that's coming out of what's happening here today. Thank <laughs> you.